and bidders call. There are fine. No he has been knocked down or passed to the hole. Not be reopened in the event of a late bid. It is absolutely essential to give you your future in number four at 19 Darling Street in Hughesdale. Before we do kick things off, buyers, I will I just go through a brief description of the property and, and uh, a few highlights of this wonderful suburb for you. Uh, our vendor's terms are just as straightforward. We do call for a settlement of 30 or 60 days and 10% deposit upon signing the contracts immediately after auction. So straightforward contract of sale, ladies and gentlemen. Straightforward auction terms and conditions under which for you to compete here this morning. And we wish you all the very best in your endeavour to secure a great little property here in Hughesdale. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it would have been about 20 odd years ago I sold this property to, uh, to John and Tina. It's been a great little investment for them, a great little workhorse. They've always had it leased out. It's certainly an opportunity now, more of a blank canvas for someone here today to take control, to get in, do a renovation, really put a personal stamp on it and really add a lot of value. When you are buying real estate and you do find a property where you can improve it, where you can add value the moment you get started, it certainly is a great place to buy and park some money. A block of only four units, the rear one, a lot of people say they prefer to be the rear or the front, if the front one that often has its own driveway. But if you are the rear unit, you don't have to worry about uh, passing cars. It's very, very private. And it often means that you do get the added bonus of quite a bit of extra land. And as you see here, it has a very, very large rear courtyard on title. Great size single lock-up garage. It isn't too tight and restricting for your car. Uh, and, and, a, and a great size two bedroom villa unit that it's uh, seen better days. I think you've all commented on that. That's fair enough. But uh, imagine today, if you were standing here, about to bid and compete for a two bedroom villa unit that had been completely renovated, how much a change that would make. So plenty of opportunity here buyers to add value. First home buyers, it's important to note we stamp duty savings up to 600. No stamp duty up to six, but if you happen to creep a little bit above that, you're looking at about $750 extra per $5,000 in the event things got a little bit carried away here today. So be mindful of that. Don't get to your ceiling and then pull up and miss out when you ask for getting a significant reduction on stamp duty and getting into your first property, a property you can renovate, add value, and becomes a great investment for you. Important to note, there is a lease on the property. We thank our tenants for their cooperation over the past four weeks. That uh, winds up in, in the early part of next year, the 22nd of, uh, the, the 22nd, I believe, of January in tw uh, 22. And are they currently paying 1,250 per calendar month. Owners' corporation fee is also reasonable, buyers, $1,600 per annum. I'm sure many of you here today have been looking at potentially apartments where there's basements, where there's a, a large amount of properties, and those owners' corporation fees are upwards of three, $4,000. $1,600 per annum is certainly very reasonable. Where you're standing, it's always important to buy great location, ladies and gentlemen. You can't go and change location, can you? You're flanked by some beautiful period-style homes up and down Darling Street. It's a great place. Hughesdale Primary around the corner if you do have children. Early Learning Centre up on Kangaroo Road. Sacred Heart Girls around the corner. Bryan Street Childcare. You're an easy stroll into the heart of Oakley. And very, very comfortable stroll also into the heart of Hughesdale. Jump on the train there. Jump on the train there at Oakley. Everything is literally just steps away from where you're standing here today, ladies and gentlemen. Plenty of reasons to put up your hand to bid and buy. Wonderful suburb, plenty of parkland, plenty of schools, walk to all amenities. You've got record low interest rates, buyers. A great time to be getting into the market and you're buying into an area where it has a median house price of just shy of one and a half million dollars. So you've got wonderful potential for capital growth investing here in number four at 19 Darling Street in Hughesdale. Buyers keen to get things underway and now that you get on with your weekend, enjoy some sunshine. If you are a first time auction attender, you wish to bid here today, just call out your bid in a nice clear voice. Seek assistance from Andrus or Andrew and it's who happy to help you out with your bidding. I'll call it down for you three times, once, twice, 
on the third and final call when the contract hits my hand, like so, the property will be sold. So make no mistake, ladies and gentlemen, no and this, but Matt, I'm sorry I didn't understand. Third and final call before the contract, the property will be sold. I have no instructions, ladies and gentlemen. We don't need to have a half time break. We can go straight through to a sale. Certainly is our intention, but that'll be up to you guys, of course. So ladies and gentlemen, buyers, we'll put it across to you now, ask you for a fair bid or offer. 510 to 550 has been the quote. Hit me off the bottom end of that range if you like. Don't mind the start, buyers, in your hands now. You can say five. 500 from anyone. 490, 480, where do you want to start? Don't mind. Here you get the property sold. Where do we see a start, buyers? I can kick things off on behalf of the vendor. 470. Where was that one? 470. Welcome to you, sir. $470,000. 500. 500 now, sir. 5. You can go back to 520. 510. 510, that's fine. 510. 510 now. At 510, two of you in there at 510 to bid now. 510 with our starter against you now at 510,000. At 510, we'll take 10 of the rise from here at $510,000. At 510. Can you say? Won't take the 5, take the 10 though, guys. Come back to 10 out of 520. 520 of these. 520, 530, sir. 520 here now at $520,000 on the top step. At 520 and 10, you like to go now, buyers at 520,000 a bid now. At 520, two of them in it now at $520,000. 10, you like to go at 520,000. At 520, we'll pull it down three times, you're all done. At $520,000. At 520, first time in at $520,000. Twice in at $520,000. At 520, all done. All silent then at $520,000. 525. Take your 10, sir, 530. Five You've had your five. coffee, you're all fired up. How about 530? Can't take your five. 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 Hold your five. 520 here. Take your 10 to 530, though. 500, 530, welcome to you here at 530 now. At 530. 40. 540, welcome back. 540, 50, sir. 540, three of you in it now, one of them thinking about it, that makes four. At $540,000 here. It's a big decision, take your time, I'm not here to rush you along. $540,000. $540 bids are here, it's against our starter, sir, haven't forgotten you. At 540, can we say 50? 540, 50, good on you, 550, great decision. At 550, 10 of you like there, guys, at 500. And 560. 560 now at 560. At 560 now. At 560, 10 you like to get yourselves involved now at 560. Get stuck into that coffee system away from your bid. 560. At 560,000 dollars then. At 560. Bids are here now at 560,000 dollars. 560. Hooray Andrews, you live in Hughesdale, tell them how great it is. 560. First time at $560,000. Have a way the baby cry. Oh. Twice set at $560,000. Go 565. Just before you hear it, 5 we'll take you 5 at 565 and 5 from yourself also at 570, can we say? Come straight back in. 565, 570. Yeah, need a second. Need a second, that's all right. 565, 570 now at 570. And five? 570. And five can we say at $570,000. Against you here. At 570. $570,000. 30 or 60 days. Bit of rent coming in after that. $570,000, plan your renovation. $570,000. Give me a few moments to think about it. Can we see you back at 575? 570 here. Once in at $570,000. Twice in at $570,000. Let's Third and final time in at 570. Five can we say? 580. 580 here at 580. Thank you, Tony. 580, we're on the market. We are selling the bank for keys. 
had $580,000. Consider his timing when he's come in, hoping to scare you off. $580,000, knows what he's doing. 585, 585 now, 585. 590 straight back here at 590. Waves us off. Have a think about it. Chat to your daughter. She will again go. 590 bids in at $590,000. Had 590 on the market. We are selling ladies 600. and gentlemen. 600? Six hundred? Six hundred? Six. I thought you said a million. I'm making sure. <laughs> six, that, that's, we are in Hughes, so it can happen. It's six hundred thousand now. Six ten. Six one zero. Twenty. Six twenty here. Six thirty. Thirty now. 40. Six thirty. Forty now. Six forty. Fifty. Fifty now. Six fifty. Sixty. Seventy. Six seventy now. Six hundred and seventy. Eighty. Six eighty. Six eighty. Eighty-two and a half. Eighty-five. Eighty-two and a half. Eighty-two and a half. Eighty-five. Six eighty-five. Two balls here, fellas. 685. $85,000. Tony, how about it? One. 685 is the number here. At $685,000 a bid. At $685,000. I hope not counting cash. Send the deposit that briefcase. 685000 a bid here. At 685, we bid. Haven't forgotten my starter there in yourself, sir. At $685,000. 685. We all done, all silent at $685,000. So you out, out here guys. 685 is a number here with this gentleman at $685,000. We're on the market and selling at $685,000. Take a one involved. 686. 686. 686. 690. 688. 688 here. 688. $688,000. 690. 690. 690. 695. 695. It's $695 now. Had six hundred ninety-five thousand dollars. Still not paying stamp duty on six hundred. Six hundred ninety-five. It's his. His? Well, Jed, still could be yours. Six nine five. Was right, sir, wasn't it? Six nine five. Six hundred ninety-five thousand dollars. One buys at six hundred ninety-five. Why gets six ninety? Ninety-six. Ninety-seven. 97. <laughs> 697. No Test him out. Go one more. 697. 697. Dory can walk to Sacred Heart Girls around the corner. 690. Sell the car, walk to the shops. Spend the money here instead. 698. I'll have to sell the clothes as well. <laughs> Sure. 697. $697,000. Once $697,000. Twice then at $697,000. Third and final time then buyers at $697,000. It'll make it a lot easier for Andrews. His maths isn't too strong if you make it $700,000 for the contracts. 698. All out. All out. Six hundred and ninety-eight. Six hundred and ninety-eight, Andrew. Six ninety-eight with this gentleman. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Sure, you're out here. Yeah. Six hundred and ninety-eight thousand dollars. Just confirm that bid, sir. Six ninety-eight with yourself. It's six hundred and ninety-eight thousand. Once in at six hundred and ninety-eight. Twice in at six hundred and ninety-eight. Third and final time. 700, welcome to you, sir, at seven. $700,000 now. At seven, sir, and against you now. 700 a bit here, now at seven. Round numbers. There you go, man. Help you out with your maths. 700, 500. 700 and a half. Take a bit at $700,500, sir. 705, can we say? 701. 701. I'm going to try. 701, 702. 500. and a half. 500. 
2.5 million. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. When we get to these numbers, it always gets tricky. 701,000, 702,500, 702,500. Seven oh three and a half or seven oh three? Seven oh seven oh two five hundred here. Seven oh three. Seven oh three. Seven oh three here. That's seven hundred and three thousand dollars. Five hundred more, man. Seven oh three and a half. Seven oh three and a half. Seven oh five might be what'll do it. It's seven oh three and a half now. Seven oh three five hundred now, sir, against you. Seven oh three five hundred. That's seven hundred and three five hundred. We are big, sir. Seven oh five. Seven oh four and a half thousand. Seven oh four and a half. Five hundred. Seven hundred and five thousand. Seven oh five. Seven hundred and five thousand here. Two of you in it now. Seven oh five. 705, sir. They're out. Been terrific. Thank you. $705,000. At 705, sir, it's with you. At $705,000. 100%? Yep. Yep. At $705,000. Once then, at $705,000. Twice then, at $705,000. Third and final time, at $705,000. All done. Silent. Seven oh five and a half. Seven oh five and a half. Seven oh five and a half. Lucky I'm a young fit man, so you almost got my heart going for this job. Seven oh six and a half. Seven oh six and a half thousand. Seven oh six and a half. Seven oh seven. Seven oh seven. Seven oh seven. You go seventeen. Might get there anyway. You get there first, it might save you some dollars. Seven oh seven. Can we say seventeen? 707 is a bid. $707,000. 707, sir. 710? 500. 707 and a half. 707 and a half. 17, sir. Get there first. 707 and a half. 710. 785. Seven oh eight five hundred. Seven oh eight five hundred is the number here. It's seven hundred and eight thousand dollars five hundred. So no, we're, we're out, yeah. Yeah. I'll pull it down three times for you so you can put in one more bit at the end. How about it? Have a chat with them. Seven hundred and eight and a half thousand dollars. I would estimate about a, a seventy thousand dollar renovation here. All of that land and you wouldn't be overcapitalizing at seven hundred and eight and a half thousand dollars. We are well north of our reserve, but you guys determine the market at the end of the day. It's seven hundred and eight and a half thousand dollars. First time then at seven hundred and eight and a half. Twice at seven hundred and eight and a half thousand. Third and final time at seven hundred and eight and a half thousand dollars. Be all done. Sure. 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 Seven hundred eight and a half thousand dollars. Once, twice, three times. All done. All silent. We are selling. Selling. And so, congratulations. Well done. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of Andrew Prickop.
Andrew Crawford, the whole team at Ray White Carnegie, thank you very much for your attendance here this morning. Have a wonderful and safe weekend. Thank you.